Welcome back everyone. Welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 4. We are, uh, we have killed quite a few um, super mutants over here in this place. And in this building, no, sorry, that building over there, we've seen some pre-war stuff. Some pre-war logs. Jeez. Talking about a shelter that the dad built for the family. Now, he said that he taught his young kids a rhyme. That the shelter is behind their, their daddy's shop in an overturned train. And they have to enter it from the top. Is that his shop? Wait a second. I've seen... We've seen a uh, Mr. Handy here last time. Oh, there's another... Wait a second. Weren't we here before? No, we, we haven't. But there is a power armor here. There's the Mr. Handy. Legendary Lieutenant Gutsy. That's interesting. Combat inhibitor. Let's go for that. No, come on, come on, come on. Hit him. Yeah, oh my... We one-shot him. That is insane. We one-shot the thing. Bloody hell. Whoa! Well, I'm guessing that Mr. Gutsy has... A oh. It must have caused uh, the car to catch fire due to its explosion. That was quite interesting. Uh, right. Let's see what this has. Oh, yeah. It's got the X01 things. Let's take all that. Nice. Lovely. I could take all these power armors back home, I guess, but... Yeah. Um... Plasma cartridge. Oh, there's something up there as well. This was, this was some kind of a checkpoint here. Let's get it. Fusion cells. Nice. Not bad. So where is this supposed shop? There's Mr. Gutsy. Vats enhanced 44 pistol. Improved Vats hit chance. 25% less action point cost. Eh, not too bad, but... Eh, not really what I want. So this is just a billboard. Hmm. I mean, billboard, it's an ad board, but I was kind of hoping I had already found this place. There must be something here crawling about. Where are we, actually? Oh, wow. University point. There's so much to explore in this game. I absolutely adore it. Well, anyway, oh, ghouls. I don't think we'll really find... What was that? Oh. I see you. Here you go. Oh, she's throwing grenades. Whoa! Plasma grenade. Bit of an overkill there, Piper. Bit of an overkill. Um. Still here? What are you shooting at? Whoa! <laughs> Not bad. Where's the other one? Are they down here? No. Where are they? I don't see it. Oh. Well. Anyway, we'll uh, explore this place next time. Let's go back because we have a few quests to hand in. <clears throat> well, with a few, I mean. Meet Travis in the dugout in after 6pm. Well, it's that's right now, actually. Let's go over there. And uh, see if we can persuade that guy that he's tough. Because it'll be a... Oh, thank you. Dugout in. There it is. Now we come. It, pal. Gouger. Get lost. Hey there, pal. Oh, it's you. <laughs> looks like trouble. Well, this whole situation looks like trouble. I, I didn't start this. I don't... I have no idea what I did to deserve this. I just wish they'd go away. <laughs> Why not stand up? Why not stand up to them? No. I mean, no. That would be bad. With these men, it could... Well, it, it, it could turn violent. Tired of this? Yeah. Make it happen. Nothing will change unless you make it happen. It's not that bad. I can just, I can just, I can just deal with this. 
Don't worry. I've got your back. Well, if you think it would work, we're right behind you. I'm pretty sure he's gonna think okay. we did all this stuff. That's well. No. What do they do? That's enough. What do they take? Oh, hey, hey, I'm sorry. You, you say something. Now. How do I? I just want to have my fists out. There. I said. I said so that's enough. Cleaning out another. Leave house me alone. Who was it? Don't know. <laughs> Look at you now. Hmm. Let me think about that for a second. Um, nah, I don't think so. I, I mean it. Leave me alone. Well, sounds like you were thinking about saying or else. <laughs> were you, Travis? Were you gonna say? Or else. I'm wondering what comes after that. What you gonna do, little man? Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll beat you up! Big mistake, Travis. I'm gonna destroy you and your friend here. Um, Piper, please don't shoot them. Ow! Ow. What? Yeah, that's right. Ow! Come on. There you go. Oh, God, my jaw. <laughs> bullshit, man. Just bullshit. This is bullshit, man. <laughs> this is not what I signed up for. Wait, is, is that it? Over? You hear me? Oh, there we go. He's gone. <laughs> hey, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean hi. You know, again. Uh, the May is okay in my book. Hi. He's kept the ghouls out. Hi. Yeah, hey. You did it, Travis. That means he's Whoa. working for it. Shh. I can't believe it. We did it. How do you feel? I knew you had it in you. I can't. I can't believe it. You were right. Oh. I've. I've got things to do now. Listen, really, I I can't thank you enough. <clears throat> you know what I'm thinking? this might be bad what if he becomes you know a thug now or a raider or or worse he gets himself himself killed we'll see the wall sure looks hey, man. good lately hey vidi <laughs> i think that went well <laughs> ready for the next part of foolproof plan okay what's that depends on what it is it's nice and simple you have seen scarlet yes she has worked here for some time now, I am just simple bartender, but I see things. I see how Travis looks at her, and I see that sometimes she looks at him. <laughs> if someone who was not her employer suggests that she go spend time with Travis, it might do him some good. Hmm, okay. I could have a chat with her. <laughs> yes, I know. This is why I'm telling you. Just do whatever <clears throat> it takes to get her to agree to see Travis. And this will all be worth it. And you and I never talked about this, all right? Well, I mean, we do have 10 charisma. <laughs> Convince Scarlet to meet Travis. Bone <laughs> Stop by the I thought she was in here. But let's find her anyway. So where is Scarlet? Everyone in this city is always jumping at shadow. Scarlet, she's probably in her own house. <laughs> Two private dicks. Oh, what's she doing here? Hey, Scarlet. Wait, what happened? Oh. Miss? I'm on a break right now. Uh. Can I ask you something personal? It's about Travis. Travis? Really? Did he... Did he mention me? Oh, wow. Well. I heard about the fight. Travis was... Well, he was brave. Um. Yes, he was. Yeah. Absolutely. You should really pay him a visit. You think? I mean, I've definitely noticed him. Maybe... No. No, I couldn't just go over there. Bribe, threaten, persuade. <laughs> Let's persuade her. Look, Travis is a nice guy. I can tell that you like him. And I think he likes you. Just go talk to him. Okay, I will. I'll go see him now. Thanks. <laughs> well, killing super mutants, uh, dishing out justice, flirting, and being a dating agent apparently is in a day's uh, 
business of an adventurer from pre-war times. Now in apocalypse times. Man, I'll have to rethink that name. It's a bit too long. And now I have a phone. Excuse me. Sorry about that. It was a rather important phone call, but there we go. All right, so, um... You, it ain't just a story. University Point, that settlement on the coast, wiped out by since. Oh, that was the thing we saw there on the map that we haven't gone to yet. University Point, there it is. Interesting. Uh, we also have to go to Bunker Hill because we've only went past it. We haven't actually visited it yet. And apparently it's some kind of a settlement. Wait, should we follow her? See what happens? Maybe we should. See what they say to each other. I mean, it's right here. DCR. Diamond City Radio. Let's see. Come on. Alright. Oh. I have to wait. No, no, no. Come on. They're gonna be speaking already. I should have gone in front of her, I guess. There we go. <clears throat> Diamond City Radio. I don't, I don't, uh... Okay. I usually... Wait. Don't... Oh, my God. This is why. This is why. Hey, man. Hey, Travis. This radio station, um... Well, uh, <laughs> well uh, you'll notice there aren't any other ones. So... Wait, what happened to your guts? Come on. Hey, Scarlet. I'm on a break right now. Um, okay. So I guess there's nothing. Well, let's go and finish the quest then. <clears throat> and, uh, see if that actually makes him more gutsy. Mr. Gutsy. <laughs> I'm not roughed up. I'm fine. I'm completely fine. I'm almost completely healthy with a tad of radiation. Man, this cool music. So there he is. This is terrible. What? Oh, I knew it. I knew it. He was up to no good, and look what's happened now. What happened? I help. I can't do it. You've got to help me. What? What? I have no idea what's going on here, Yafim. They took him. They took Vadim. The, those men, the, the ones that messed with Travis, they came back. Said Vadim owed the money, that they had a deal. He, he wouldn't pay, and then they grabbed him and said that they would make him pay. And then they just dragged him out. You have to do something. Please tell me you can do something. Maybe we could get Travis. <laughs> do you know where they took him? No, I don't know. He's the one that uh, has always dealt with them. I've tried to avoid them. But Travis might know. You should ask him, please. I don't want anything to happen to Vadim. How would Travis know about those thugs? Huh. Well, let's go and check it out. Why didn't he pay them? I mean, they had a deal. Jeez. Vadim? What the heck are you doing? It's raining! They say the old Boston Commons got some crazy bird living in it. Crazy bird? Well, that's another place that was uh, uncovered on our map. And there's Diamond City Radio. Let's go ask... What's going on? Travis. Uh, seen Vadim? Oh. I need your help. Vadim's been kidnapped by Bull. That's not funny. Think it's a joke? This is serious. I'm not joking around, Travis. This is serious. I really do need your help. Wait. Really? Oh. Oh, man. Wow. Is this... This is because of what happened, isn't it? It's... It's my fault. And now he's going to be able to do this for real. Um, it's not really your fault. No, Travis, this is between Vadim and those men. It's not your fault. But if I hadn't gotten into that fight with them, maybe this wouldn't have happened. Don't do that to yourself. All we can do now is figure out how to make this right. Look, I don't, I don't really, I mean, I don't have a lot of friends. If Vadim is missing or in trouble or whatever, then I'm going to help get him back. Uh, okay. It's dangerous. It's probably going to be dangerous. I expect things will get ugly. I'm not... I, I'm not stupid. I know that. I've heard enough to know they'll probably hold up at the old Beantown Brewery. We've got to go in there, show them we mean business, and, and then we can bring Vadim back, and everything will be okay. Right? I'll... 
I'll get a gun and I'll meet you there. We'll settle this. Wait, what? We're just shooting them all? I'm on a break right now. Yes, I know you're on a break. Um, well, that's interesting. So let's... Scarlet. No. Okay. <laughs> let's go out. No, and now she's... <laughs> I wanted to go out before she did because she locked us out now. I Come gotta, on. Uh, I gotta get my stuff together. And I'll meet you there. All right, that's, that's fine. Uh, so, what? We're just gonna shoot them all? <laughs> Um, there, Travis Beantown Brewery. Okay, let's go to Oberlin Station. Uh, let's see if we can help this place a little bit. I mean, they've got a lot of food. Zero defense. Uh, three water. Well, they certainly need more beds and such. We haven't done anything about this place, actually. Hmm. They need some power first. Uh, let's build this one five. Let's build it here, I guess. Look at that. There we go. Do we already have a supply line going here? I'm not sure we do. I guess we do because we have all that stuff. Let's put that over here. Where it'll look proper. Um. Attach wire. Ah, oh, darn it. Connectors and switches. We need one of these, I guess. Let's see if that'll reach. It will. Nice. Uh, it's kind of floating. Hmm. Oh, I guess it's still fine. Right, so... We need this. And then they need some more water. Resources. Water. Do they have any water sources nearby? Well, they do over there, but it's kind of far away, so they'll have to do with these. Here, and... Maybe one over here. That one? There. And, of course, more beds. Beds. The small, nice ones. Oh, can't actually go through here. I'm guessing the upstairs is full. Well, not quite. I think I can have one more bed here. Actually, like that. <laughs> and then more beds. What's downstairs? Can we actually go downstairs? Oh. Doesn't appear like we can. No, the downstairs is just completely... Huh, blocked. What's the point in that? Well, they, they need some houses then. Oops. And uh, defenses. So let's see. Um, structures. Wooden structures. Oh. Wait, what? Miscellaneous. Well, that's interesting. I have a cage. What's that all for? I've never seen these before. Did they add this? Ugh. What the hell is this totem? Ugh. That's kind of cool, actually. So wait a second. Um, metal. Prefab. Oh yeah, of course I need the prefabs. There. I need the houses. There we go. Uh, small shack. Needs steel and wood. Where should we place it? There's not really a good place here. It's always gonna sort of float in the air. Hmm. I'm not a huge fan of that, but there we go. Eh, it's gonna sort of float. Oh well. No, I don't want to put it into the inventory. Now I need those beds. No, not shells. Beds. Well, let's put him in there. Uh, yeah, that's a fairly tiny uh, little house. Come on. Come on. Almost have it. There we go. Another bed here. Ooh. Come on. Uh, there. Yes. They can't even get to the beds, but that's fine. 
Alright, so that's eight beds. Happiness is going down for some reason. This guy will be uh, sleeping in the wild, in the bushes. <laughs> oh, I can't place that bad there. Come on. There we go. Alright, I think that's fine. Now they just need some defenses. Ah, uh, guard post turrets. Well, I don't have any aluminium, unfortunately. Although... Wait a second. There is a, um... Workshop thing here. So I can just transfer all the junk. And her junk as well. Hey. <laughs> Alright, give me your junk, Piper. Aluminium, that's what I'm talking about. Alright. All the junk goes here. Alright, so now we can probably put down some laser turrets as well. No, we cannot, because we still don't have the aluminium. What the hell? Oh well. Heavy machine gun turrets it is. There, they've got 16 defense. Let's give them a little bit more still. I think that's pretty good. One more and they'll be fine. Because the, uh, the place will get bigger anyway. So, there we go. There's already four people here. It was two when we started out. Alright, that's pretty good. So now, we need to go uh, that way, to the brewery thing. I'm guessing... No, 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 that's not it. It's over there somewhere. So, thank you very much for watching, and we're gonna continue next time. Bye-bye.